Good morning, fellow Amazonians. Today, na Tuesday, number 15 day for number 11 month for the year 2022. My name na Capo Daniel. I am the Deputy Defense Chief of the Ambazonian Defense Forces and the spokesperson of the Ambazonian Governing Council. We want to welcome to our daily podcast. This one na a program where they talk the truth, where they bring una meaningful information for help we navigate this journey to our freedom, the independence of Ambazonia. Revolutionary greetings to all our refugees and IDPs and asylum seekers of Ambazonia. And shout out to all our freedom fighters. Good people of Ambazonia. For this episode for today, I go one for put the record straight. Would not be extremely busy with our obligation for the governing council in the numerous ongoing diplomatic engagement for our country and uh, we need the, the communication department will nobody work in full steam but this one are good news each time when i need to hear from we will need to be capable of doing live show maybe we not that because we'll be, we'll be engaged in other obligation them for our country so i will title this episode say set the record straight i will use this opportunity for set the record straight but first, I will first talk about which way it happened from Banja. For Banja, they picking them for grandpa for, for, for our wing day. I think they the only soldier that for inside the Savannah way. We don't talk say they with the AMF 100%. Now for the way, uh, A4 be good day. They go meet up before they before go enter that shock. So all oh, know the history. Some of that soldier, them for the day, they don't torment our people them from Banja unjustly. Yesterday, one person where they be catchy, go down for bush. They don't can dumb the person if they die body for in some banja day. Several times our population from banja, they don't be try for be weaponized by uh, the republic. They don't reject them. They don't get excesses them for day. The population, the one toxic, the one protest, I wouldn't calm them down several times. So this time, one Quincy George Ngwa, where they can take it for a house for Thursday. For one Thursday, I think it that make like two weeks ago. So the fighter the way they come up for day, they come from Banja day. Now fighter the way they be there for a wing. As I don't explain for now. They can catch the man around Banshe day for Banshe quarter for day. Then go ye. They don't come back. They ask for 1.7 million. The family no game. They don't can kill it through him for day. This one will be unacceptable. We the call on all those soldiers them way they don't come for inside that area from Banja. May they know say when you commit a crime, you de put all the others who their life at risk. And I don't want to assure the population from Banja, say the governing council it be engaged with everybody for ground. And would come for public because now public matter now with their body then they for down. For talk me what people then be calm. We will make sure say we will resolve this issue. The Ambazonian Defense Forces who are come around that area, they then be engaged, the case then be passed down for make sure say make justice it be done. Now an internal Ambazonia matter who go handle them for that level. But may our population be sure say these things that they be taken into. And make all Ambazonian fighters they know. So whatever you are doing, a record is being kept. Eventually there will be accountability for what everything you are doing in the name of our struggle. Farmer they know if you go for farm for instance Banja they they catch them every day. All this group them for ground zero where they deny political leadership because they the one begin to do wrong things them. You know, go war, you know, go happen. And any Ambazonian way they for diaspora, where they give them legitimacy or support, think very well. Try for study all this group the way they claim say them be independent. Sometimes that gun self they be seen by our community, saying a gun where they protect themselves against civilian, they not even against the Republic. Yes, one one time they be go carry out good action. But may they know say this type of things, now they put people for jeopardy. Because now we hear the people them for inside Banja, they even name some Banja boy the way they be there with them for a win, they don't bring them for inside Banja. 
So when I feel say the population for Banja, they no go feel resist. They go resist. They want freedom. We we'll push them in the hands for hell. We we'll push them for hell. So we must stop all these things and make sure they make all legitimate Ambazonian soldiers, the way they fight for the population, put the population in interest first. These are things we agree in Toronto. These are not the thing that the only the egg of sea is pushing. It's not only the egg of sea pushing these things. All the other soldiers, their representative, where they become for Toronto. At least we now know everybody in, in every soldier and where they stand. So the manipulation and train of the dust is gone. So anyway, wait till I want to put the record straight today. I will bring a lot of issues the way they can be raised by eternal spoilers. People the way they live for Ambazonia, but they do work for La Republic where they don't know. Because when La Republic they degenerate propaganda, anti Ambazonia propaganda, then you as an Ambazonian, you spread and feel say you attack na individual them. You de actually instead help na La Republic for deliver their material for place where they know if you do them. The first thing we want to talk, I will first start with the issue of success in Congo and Nambere. Two Ambazonians them, where they be the fight for Ambazonia, but they don't switch side for La Republic to come around to work for the enemy. They fight against their own people them. When I be see how they be bribe success in Congo, he come for Nigeria, he even show receipt for the money they be selling for them. About 30 million for ye and 30 million for, for Nambere. That money he don't finish. When I don't see the threaten La Republic, their prime minister, he did do all this thing. Nambere, he did do the same. That money he don't finish. That money be been a big money with the began for them because they be they expect a lot. They be done deceive La Republic because they're cunning and a scammer them. Even before this struggle one start success in Congo, it be been a scammer. But nevertheless, that person where he be stand for try for fight for a country, as far as I can tell. Even though now is con man, this struggle it give people a second chance for do good for their country and for turn their life around. Make all money seize the opportunity. But make we know to say La Republic, they did look advantage for people the way they be vulnerable. Former con people, they did look any people where they get conny, they will try to exploit them. Today, we will see number there, they expose La Republic, success Congo, they expose them. We need to take full advantage and we will encourage them to do more. But they are traitors and traitors and get na one end. Now they gallow the with them. They will be hung publicly for treason. Because when you abandon people for war, you expose them, you take money, chop them, say so that they go kill them. No expect anything different from you. You receive the coin of Judas. It better for them for hang themselves. Then we Ambazonia will go free forgive them for the crime of treason and high treason. So when I listen for number, this one will be saying we're gonna pay attention for anything where they do them. Because people like this they don't get any credibility, they don't get nothing for offer. We will pick and choose the things that will feel taken for them. The rest are garbage. At, these are traitors. Any man if he turn it back for his people, then do in war. So they go sell their other soldier them. Convince them and drop down gone. That person need he deserve only one end. Hang it. Or if they get honor, me then commit suicide. No say you don't take advantage for this struggle for make yourself popular. I will when he attack people them. So foolish. I mean, my way no get sense. Go follow you for back. But I'll tell you one thing happened one day for company. Some black leg boy. Got tell you, I'm going to say, I'm going to back my one. So now, legit information where the game. You know, say that play for company for Shannon, they get play the chop. I go cut the part them as a now because all the rest are garbage. For this audio, it explain for them how we one black leg, black leg na a traitor. Na an Ambazonian way it work for the colonial government for La Republic, they give information for soldier. This person he can't lie the La Republic the agenda they say some person the way they work with Ambazonian force freedom fighter them. The La Republic the agenda them then carry for Google key that person where that person will be an innocent person. When I know how Kunyam titles and they they come for people that village gather name for SDF and people they, they don't always oppose the regime. They will put them for as I say me like Republic, then go key them. I say they, they key innocent people them every day. So he explained, I say, even when they, they go for go key that innocent person, the La Republic, their occupation terrorist Bulu Beti forces, then they, they tell ye the number and say, if they go for that place, 
Ibina actually Ambazonian fighter and then they shoot fire, they return fire for them. One man get wound. They go kill na them first before they go back. So it show na say la republic na la republic na a foreign country. They go continue for the kiwi. All we na the same for their eye. Different only. Anyone will go chop money for them. Na your head go go. At the end of the day, your head go still go. So number and success go on. Then get lucky say they still their life or talk. Maybe God they keep them so that na Ambazonia go pay for them. The crime the way they don't commit them for our state. I like how you don't just bring out a story for 1010. For me, I mean, understand that 1010 is die commander inside the DR center. I'm going to tell you about the DR center. The DR center will see and so. The other one day where they carry go bush for maybe a lem. I still get a boy a picture of her. Shoot and kill him. Maybe they first don't shoot plenty. Plenty. Then kill him. But what you're not faithful, understand, I see. So, it explained how La Republic they can move that boy them for that so called DDR center them. They want the way a true true fighter they, they go kill key them one by one. They, they use any motif for kill them. So that one I just some few things that I want I want show now. The end of the matter and I say bribery and corruption cannot defeat Ambazonian liberation war. They don't use sabotage. They don't use blackmail. Or they don't fade away. They don't use bribery and corruption. The time where they bring success in Congo. And refugee them, it go mix them with Ni Nigeria people. It don't fail. They don't go back for square one. So bribery and corruption it need to ever work. But when we publicize them, just like we publicize them for success in Congo, now for neutralize the effect, the intended effect for the Republic. Wait to be the record where I want to set and straight today. When I don't hear some spoilers and the Republic to Cameroon enable us by default, they don't come outside, they detox it. Capo Daniel, Abitoxi, no pity, he don't receive money for La Republic. That is a complete lie. And this lie, it be paddled around by Vela Franklin. Whatever this boy, he define him for this struggle, now God he alone, he know. But that is a witchcraft we have in Ambazonia. I had said previously in one of my audio, say, Dampolo, Babandawara, he don't pay he money, he don't pay money for plenty soldier them. I know be the talk now say it means say that they work for La Republic. I be the explain for them now which way happen. Most of the evidence, the way the governing council get them about this case, it be come now during the time where for inside Boyo, they be kill some fighter where it be the hell for logistic for they for provide weapons them. At that time it be involved General Nyi and most of those people them. Uj Icho and all of those people they be to work for the IG at that time. When I remember, I set up the forces for RK, the British Southern Cameroon Resistance Forces, who will build something good. During the engagement with those soldiers, they will be reveal the network for Ndawara, where it will pay, where to will go call them, say, because that one will be taxed. That one will talk, say, na, na, na security money. In Ndawara, they pay money for soldiers. Then all that come them. There is no come. I mean, there is no come in Menchum, in Boyo, where in Ndawara, they need to pay, they come them money for. Uh, security money that means they don't attack a cow them so just because we explain for people then say Ndawara don't pay people money you know means say Ndawara they control those people you know means they control those forces even general ivor bandam too be don't give him money and that way they be giving money he be disclose them for the adf because adf get a structure for accountability and they be make sure say that money you know go affect the conduct or ambazonia struggle for the when are the reason that way you would always talk to me all force then they for structure because if you do you by yourself you do receive money for up and down up and down tomorrow you will start be answerable to those people then if you not be careful so so that in the way they take money for kind kind place with people they don't even know but when you get a structure for accountability it will protect the struggle and it will shield the struggle from the effect for being exploited by cameroon intelligence so meguna know Say the issue for Ndawara paying soldier them, nothing will be known publicly. And when we talk, um, you know, mean I say we want tax some person say to work for La Republic, would they simply expose these things because this light, light defy through the kill darkness. When we talk, and so the, the enemy could be unable for use that exploit for exploit those soldiers. And because once they give you money for back, back you take them for back, you're not talking for public, you don't already fall trap because they know so you get some security, fear me, people they don't know. And they go use them for manipulate you. So those are the calculations we make sometime in the ADF before we put certain public information out. We will always work with every soldier. We are collaborating with uh, No Pity. He have a very good 
relationship with us through our major general in Bui, General Kapo, and will continue to do so. When we have differences with his forces of Marine of Bambalang, we address it as a force of Ambazonia. When we have concern about forces, we will, will never be afraid to put it out there and try to resolve it. That is what we do responsibly. Regarding the issue of uh, General Araki, I had come out and explained to the Ambazonian people that the ADF had intelligence. We had intelligence that he was in, in, uh, in ground one on his way to Ghana. When we put out that information, it was not a made-up story. There was actual evidence that was collaborative and substantiated that that was the case. And uh, he came out four days later to make a video that went against what he was saying because he, he initially said that he's not going to respond and make a video that we wanted him to pick, make a video so that the public would know where he is. And I came out and I said that you can make a video even in a room and hide your location and just show people that make the population know that you are not there because when we know that you are going there we are very concerned because of the rule you play we we are a free country we must speak our mind so after four days he made a video in ground zero anyway even exposing a sensitive place around a general gula there which wasn't supposed to be to be done that way and that was not no, was not good the reason i want to bring this issue is for ambassador people to trust us and trust our intention when we do things we are patriot, we are the good guys, and we don't do things because we want to hurt people. We do things because we want to protect them and protect our struggle. This is the truth that you have to know. Ambazonian forces, many of them were removed from Ground Zero to Ghana, by uh, her, assisted by Dr. Bebeneza Kwanga and the Sukadev, the APLM, who were working with international organizations that were facilitated by the Swiss HD. Those soldiers were brought there and they were trained in human rights and other things. The ADF have a different position. The Ambazonian Governing Council is that we train our own soldiers about human rights. We have developed materials for human rights. We have a charter for human and people's rights. And that is our approach. So we oppose the HD's facilitation of removing soldiers on the ground. General A4 was part of those groups. Um, uh, you have our sister Mama Ji who was killed was there many generals in the ground left there and they are hiding it they don't want people to know for whatever reason I don't know this is not even supposed to be a secret if it is done in good faith so those things have happened if anybody tries to 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 twist these issues these incidents because they think that they want to attack Capo Daniel no they are just making an excuse to attack Ambazonia for whatever reason, nobody knows their intention or their motivation. But we know that when you use things negatively, you are helping nobody but the Republic. When you attack the most credible Ambazonian voice, <coughs> the most trusted Ambazonian activist, Capo Daniel, and the spokesperson of the governing council, you are inevitably attacking the liberation movement when you do so unfairly, unjustly, and with distorted information. So, Vela Franklin... What you are doing is helping La Republic. You are not helping Ambazonia. And you do not speak for the governing council. You cannot because you are not even a member of the governing council. You can be a militant or a supporter. But you should stop all those your distractions and lies and manipulation. They also accuse me of working with other forces. One would expect that every normal Ambazonia will be happy. And this incident is an incident that took place in Donga. There are certain issues in Donga where only... The forces that were, were previously saying that they are with Sako, or they still say they are with Sako, only them can do because they master that area very well. And when we want to do something, and I do it, I don't do it by myself because I represent an organization. I make a requisition to the, to the War Council, I justify the operation, I rationeer it, and I say that we should support these soldiers with so and so amount of money for an operation. It was approved by the governing council. The, the budget, those things with officials, we don't even touch budget. Money was transferred to them through our leadership on the ground for an operation. And they lost a soldier in that operation. So this guy out there is accusing me of collaboration. What, what type of strange thing is that? Would not every Ambazonia be happy that the ADF is working even with those guys? We should be happy that we are collaborating. So all these things they are doing like this should stop. We should put Ambazonian first. Each time your ego will, will jeopardize national security, drop it down and stop the distraction. 
So what I have put this information out there. Remember, when No Pity went and burned the market in Oko, we criticized him. It was not because we hate him or we oppose him. It's because we know that it was wrong and it will be counterproductive. And he listened to our advice and he had getting into collaboration with us. Those who are fighting against this collaboration, who wants to maintain enmity, who wants to create division and infighting and chaos and make it impossible for us to work together so that our soldiers should be at each other's truth. These are the demons and the witchcraft in Ambazonia. The wicked black man syndrome. They hide behind excuses to do their worst for our soldiers. They mean no good. They are not working for Ambazonia. They are working for themselves. And it should stop. You all know my heart, Ambazonia. You know how I love all our soldiers. From Aruki, I have been struggling to advise and help them. Imagine where I took him from. I gave him the force. I built the ideology and the structure of the British Southern Cameroon resistance forces. He has given us a lot of pride previously. But imagine this day of this 1st of October celebration. He was not even near the celebration ground. He could not even come close to his brothers there to work with them. Gola, General Nikora, Achu, and all those brave heroes in, in Boyo. The women who were celebrating him today, he's torturing them and doing all those things. When we were advising him, people who were blocking us from advising him and from bringing all these things, they thought that they, was help, they were helping him because they just want political relevance. And look at where he is today. Our prayer is that he should be where he was and maximize his capacity for our country. We are patriot and we will continue to do things with our nationalism and patriotic spirit. May we focus. We will beat La Republic to Cameroon. I trust, trust me. We will. We will defeat them. Bribery and corruption have failed. So do all their tactics. Nobody lose a war for decolonization. Ambazonia will not be the first. Our generation is ordained to deliver. And we will deliver. <laughs>